Hello, my little detectives. MC here today. Today, guys, there's a theory I have in mind and it's on the Moon Show, and it's about Eclipse returning back. And I have a lot of questions. Like, is that really him? It is. How did he came back? And how did he survive? And who bring him back in the first place? And does Ruin have any involvement? With Eclipse coming back, there's a lot I have in mind, and this is what I'm gonna say to you guys. That being said, shall we continue this theory? Okay, so before I play this clip of video, I know most of you guys may or may not watch the Sun and Moon show and maybe get a little bit confused what is going on. So I will be linking this video. It completes all the history and what happened in the past and many more of uh, disasters happened. So yeah, I will link it down below so you guys can watch it and understand a little better. That being said, please roll the clip. Much has happened across this show. So many things have spanned the grapevine of this tapestry. The best and the worst of it to be shown. Shall we go over the amazing lore of this insane world? It would surely be of importance. It started long ago. When sun and moon had separated their bodies from one another with the help of none other than Montgomery Gator. He had helped them acquire a new body and, well, things went from there. Months later, Sun would be taking care of a few children in the daycare, a casual day for him and moon. That was until things got violent. Fazbear cleaned it all up. Everything ended up being fine, but Sun was forever scarred because of it. And Blood Moon, well, he left Sun's body and floated around for the longest time, trying his best to pull himself back together. At some point, after many awkward nights, I brought up the idea to Moon that we could try growing closer to family and thought the idea of starting a YouTube channel. The one you're on right now. We played games, had fun with friends, and the whole shipping! That was... well... That was until Sun started to act irrationally angry at random points during video recordings and even taking care of children. Most yeah, notably Gregory. Skull. It wouldn't be until months later that the reason why Sun started to act strange and stranger was because of some code of the original moon left behind. It formatted into Eclipse, an entity left behind by the original moon and sight of Sun. He had formed his own consciousness and began to plan for a way to escape and wreak havoc on those who had wronged him. It was he who had made Blood Moon. The actual killers of July 16th. For a while, things were stuck in a standstill. One side unable to get the hand over the other. Blood Moon had been well forgotten by Eclipse at this point, and instead he had made another grand design. Me! He made me. In which I took over Moon at times to help keep him, uh, keep him in check or dumb. Because it's really weird about stuff. Anyway... After being put inside a moon, Eclipse started initiating his plan to rewrite the universe into his image of perfection with a weapon called the Star. The Newton Star, or the Star for short, was a tool devised by the original moon to fix everything that he deemed too dangerous to rewrite DNA, to undo a piece of time and change history itself. However, if it fell into the hands of the wrong person, it's unimaginable the kind of chaos that could be made with it. Eclipse initiated his plan. He locked me in his head and had Lunar put Moon away. I was tortured for the whole month of October. It wasn't... It wasn't the best day for me, but, but we, we should be thankful because if it wasn't for Monty, we'd never... These two f***s would be dead! I took the star, hid it away, and tried finding out ways to destroy it. Nothing came of it, though, unfortunately. It was during the whole month of October that... While I was trying to get rid of the star, Luna was busy dealing with Eclipse. 
Okay, after that little history we have saw, I hope this helped you guys understand we will be talking about a little bit more. So that being said, let's go to the main video we'll be discussing about. Shall we guys? So let's start complaining. Yeah, uh, they classic will. parents. What? What's that? Solar? Solar? Do you sleep up there? Solar. Sun and moon. Yeah, uh -huh. my. Already moved on from me, I see. <laughs> Got yourselves another eclipse to deal with. What? <laughs> oh, please don't act coy. As if you didn't expect this to happen. No, you're dead. You're dead. I did die. I destroyed you in another dimension. You're dead. You shouldn't be able to come back at all. Your backups and backups, smackups. Do you want to know how I survived? How? No. I think I'll keep that a little secret for now. Tell me! But it's good. Oh, is someone a little angry right now? It's good to see you again, Moon. Such a pleasant surprise to have you. And Sun. Oh, what, what, what is the others called? Solar now, right? You really could not resist having me around, could you, Moon? <laughs> okay, guys, after watching that video and knowing what happened, here is my theory video. So hear me out. I don't think that's the ritual clip. I think this is solar. If you guys remember this video, something happened to Solar as he was at the arcade machine looking for Earth or finding any clues of her whereabouts. And someone hit Solar behind his back of his head, making him pass out. As Solar slowly woke up, the one person came to his rescue was Ruin, and that's very weird and very suspicious so that being said here's a clip of this video wherever in the world she is god i hope she's all right maybe i can check up on somebody here while i'm along anyways maybe she knows something seen something i don't really oh. sola sola are you okay sola Oh, God, my head. Sola? Ruin? Oh, you're up! Congratulations! I, I saw you were, um, incapacitated. At some point, I brought you in. Ruin? What happened to you? Oh, I've repaired myself! Okay, guys, now we found out what happened. Solar has passed out, and Ruin swooped in and came to the rescue. But I think I know who hit solar the back of his head i think it is ruin because if you guys remember lately ruin has been a lot suspicious lately and i think somehow ruin found a way to go into the portal and went to back to solar's old place and find remedy or any leftover of the ritual clip and make then maybe he found a piece of eclipse and tried to build it but not a body but a little chip and when solar was not looking ruin was behind him in the back of his head and hit him and planted in a chip in solar's head and lately solar has been getting headaches a lot lately Okay, hear me out. I repeat, I repeat, I do not trust Ruin because lately he has been suspicious. First of all, he hasn't been in the daycare that often. Lately, he has been around the arcade machine or around DJ music area. He has been cleaning or fixing stuff. And third of all, he didn't tell anybody he had built himself a body already. And yes, I know everyone was busy about Blood Moon. You could just like drop by and say, hey guys, I got myself my body. And that's mostly it, and you can be off your merry way. But he didn't, he just kept it a secret for a while. 
And lastly, about the incident of going to the different bunkers and kind of spooking sun and moon out into the same bunker when they were supposed to go there and Ruin somehow found like a weird mysterious hole. But yeah, he has been suspicious lately and I don't trust him. I'm gonna play like the two video clips here and you guys might get, I hope, that being said, um, here's the video, shall we? Uh, anxiety? Paranoia? At this point, I just don't want anybody touching my systems too much. When did you do this? Oh, um, not too long after Sun and Moon gave me the schematics. Um, beside the point, are you okay? Yeah. Ugh, what hit me? I I'm not too certain. Uh, I tried looking through the camera feed while you were out, but there was nothing there. Everything was just gone, d deleted almost. Ugh, did you not? You didn't hear anything? See anything? Uh, no, I was busy in the back doing my own projects, and then, then I heard a, a yelp from you, and I came to investigate, and I found you on the floor. You didn't see anyone? At all? No, I'm sorry. I, I wish I was faster, but I, I could I didn't see anybody. I'm, I'm sorry, Sola. Right. W when did... I'm sorry, just... You you fixed your body and didn't tell any, any of us about it? I was... I'm still well, working out some kinks. There's, there's, my hand isn't entirely intact yet, but, well, I mean, operational. You get the jizz. Um, I was making sure you're okay, and it seems as though you are. Um, don't worry not. I will look through all the security cameras. You know, I'll do it instead. Uh, be my guest, of course. <sighs> Ugh. Where's the, where's the cameras here? I was knocked out right here, almost. Actually, right there. Right there? I swear, it was right there. I, I wouldn't know. I saw it. Your body was hanging right there. Right. Well, these computers should have at least the footage of it. Let's see. I can assure you, Soda. I, I mean, double-check my work. Maybe I missed something, but, but I didn't see anybody there. Besides you. God damn it. Who deleted this footage? I'm, un I'm uncertain. I I'm I'm terribly sorry. You, you uh, I understand that there's currently something happening right now within the pizza plex. Um, something with concerning Earth. Earth, Earth was kidnapped. That's horrid. Is she all right? I don't know. How long was I out for? Uh, maybe an hour at most. An hour? You could have tried waking me up. I did try waking you up. You just, you, just weren't, you just weren't responding. I thought I'd have to call my, my sun or moon, but they seemed so busy now. I, I didn't want to disturb them. I uh, didn't. I don't think. Dear God! What? Oh my God! Hi, Ruin. I'm so sorry, gentlemen. I. I'll be honest, I thought perhaps I was going to get killed for a minute. I gave you complete other bunkers. Yes, you did, and those bunkers sometimes led to other bunkers. Okay, that's fair enough. Can you explain to me why there's a massive hole back there, by the way? A what? Uh... Yes, you see, um... I was exploring the bunker that you told me to, and uh, eventually I saw a hole in one of the trap. Okay, well, let's just going to go investigate. Huh. Anyways, as I was saying, I noticed a hole in one of your traps, and it led here. And I thought, if I move, I might die. So I didn't move. So somebody dug a hole through our bunker. My bunker. Who? Oh, I can only ascertain a guess as to who. <clears throat> Let's just not kid around here. Okay, so I won't argue with Ruin. I'd probably be scared if I crawl into a hole and find out there is booby trap. But there is one thing most of us forgotten. Ruin likes to act and pretend like the actor. And he can may or may be tending to not be a good person. And maybe been acting the whole time. You guys remember this exact video. And he was pretending the whole time Blood Moon could shock him. And it was a lie. He just pretend. 
What happened? This is the situation. He may not even got the cure, and he's still himself, and he's pretending acting and lying through his teeth and pretending he is a good person, and in fact he's still an evil person, and maybe try to stay in that universe so Sun and Moon won't have to kill him. That's the only way I can think of, and I would like someone to argue with me in the comments. Please don't end this joking, but I would like to see what your guys' theory is. So that being said, I'm gonna play up this video, shall we, guys? Oh, perfect. Then it seems we have the same vibes. Go on, give it a try. Shock me. Are you surprised? You liar! Of course I lied! It never worked to begin with! You know how easy it is to fake being shocked! <laughs> what the thing is, Blood Moon? I never got rid of yours. What? Okay, so these two videos kind of came up and I got sad like all my hard work went down the drain But it's okay. We can still work on it. We know one thing per certain we cannot trust ruin just yet And we got new leads. We found out solar Monty has evidence and knew about something about eclipse and somehow eclipse survived the blast we don't know or how he did it. we just know that being said i'm gonna play up these two clip of these videos that being said let's begin shall we here they are like the other eclipses killing indiscriminately it seems like you ain't got no choice but to kill everyone from your own place don't you gosh should have killed you when i had the chance Go on, prove me right. I'm not gonna kill you. Why? You killed Moon. You killed him, didn't you? Shot him dead with that flimsy beam of yours. This should... I should... I should... What? What did you possibly say to bring me down even lower, huh? I should have told him more. What? <laughs> Monty, Monty, come on, wait, wait, Monty, please, what, what do we mean more? God damn it. Oh, come on, please be alive still. I need this. Damn it! What did you mean, Montgomery? I guess that's that then, isn't it? I can find out more on my computer anyway. Okay. What do you got for me? Nothing. No one came through? So what did Monty even mean? What did Monty even mean then? Hold on. Now that's an anomaly. It's small. What? No way. No, there's no goddamn way. Okay, doing this the hard way then. Oh, how do I activate? Maybe this will be enough. Eclipse was already here. That doesn't make sense. How was he already here? No one came earlier. No one came earlier. No one left earlier. Moon's already dead. He wouldn't even know how to build Eclipse. <sighs> but he came here. For what reason? For what purpose? Cameras can't lie like that. Can they? God damn it. I gotta get out of here. went to a different one of my bunkers because I gave him something to go check he wanted to help oh now he wants to help I don't know what's going on with him 
I don't think I really care either. Not right now, at least. Here's a deal, then. What is exactly going on? He wants to get Lunar, right? That's what you're to, telling me? To use him as a pseudo-star, I guess, yeah. Pseudo-star. Whatever. I don't doubt Lunar can defend himself, but it's Eclipse. Lunar's not a star. He can control yeah. the weather if he wants the, the world to be covered in snow, sure. I mean, he can't do anything with Lunar. He needs a... Pure. Mental manipulation thing. I don't know what you want to call it. Yeah. Whatever you want so to what call I'm it. hearing is Lunar can be used as a battery to be configured into whatever Eclipse wants. <laughs> as if I'm going to just let him. I'm not saying we're going to let him, but also, I also know Lunar can defend himself with the whole lightning, ice, weather powers. But it's also Eclipse. And any time Eclipse is ever mentioned around Lunar... He has a panic attack. I thought I'd blame him. So, I'm going to be honest. For the time being, we don't tell Lunar that Eclipse is after him. You don't want Lunar to know that Eclipse is after him? No, because I don't want one Lunar freaking out and potentially exploding with power. Because that puts Castor and Pollux on us. And whatever other <sighs> astrals are around. Okay, so let me say this before anyone get angry at me. I do not fully agree with Moon and I know sooner or later Lunar's gonna find out Eclipse is back to life and he's after him. But I guess I do believe Moon Lunar will get out of control of his powers if he found out his dead brother is back to life and is after him. So I guess it is a safe move of Moon's side, but I know sooner or later Lunar's gonna find out the truth and get very angry and betrayed by everyone who knew about this. That being said, let's go to the other theory I have in mind, shall we guys? Okay guys, here's the new information we got so far ahead. We know Monty knew about something about Eclipse or something else, but sadly he already died until like Solar blasts him to death. There is a chance Solar could take out the memory chip of Monty's head and find out what he was talking about. But there is a chance he might accidentally destroy that memory chip. So yeah. And we found out Eclipse somehow stay alive. We don't know how is a mystery. And I cannot tell you of that because I need more evidence to find out what else we can find out. Now Solar had the information he needed, he left and went back home. Okay guys, hear me out. This may be a little bit crazy, but it could be a possibility. What if Eclipse was hiding at Solar's place all along? Think about it, he's nowhere else and he has been hiding for a while. And I think he's hiding at Solar's place for a hiding place. It could be a possibility, but I could be wrong. But I think that's his new hiding spot. Hey guys, so I hope you guys enjoyed this little theory video I have been working on for so long. It took me a while, but I have fun with this. And it may be not perfect, but I try my best. Also guys, I want to mention two people I have been expired. One of them is small sweet um, strawberry. I hope I pronounced it right and now I'm so sorry. She had made her own theory video of Lunar and I thought if she can do it, I can do it. I will be linking down below of her channel. There's another person who is a talented artist but she also talked about a little bit of theory of her own and she has her own Twitter account. I will be also linking down below for her too. Also guys, before I end this, I am planning to continue on this theory and another theory of a FNAF character who I was planning to talk about for the longest time. But that being said guys, um, please guys like, comment down below, subscribe, and hit the notification bell when I post another video. That being said, this is MC, signing out. Bye guys!